I teach an engineering class here at Northern Vance High School, and I'm always looking for real-world projects. So we found this competition that NC State was running. It's called the Prize for Innovation. And the rules for entering were pretty simple. You just had to come up with some product, uh, an innovative product, that would help somebody in the community. To find a community problem, we really just began by looking in our own classroom. And I think we were just in class one day, Nick and I, and we looked around and we saw that the computers were failing. And uh, we didn't know why, so we did some investigating. We opened up the lid. And of course, there was a film of dust that had accumulated over time. But more importantly, we found that the fan was clogging. And to fix the fan would give as much an economic benefit to the community as it would just helping the classroom. These computers, not only do they fail and interfere with the classroom you know, flow, but the schools have to take money out of their budget to actually repair the computers. So it's, a, it, it's costly to the schools. It's really negative to both the classroom and the uh, school county system. So we started to think about, well, how do you clean a desktop computer? And we found out there really wasn't a good way to do it. There was only two choices. You had to disconnect everything, take the computer uh, somewhere else in the building, or bring an air can in and uh, spray it, and you had a big cloud of dust all over the place, which seemed to make the problem uh, worse than it was originally. So we started to design our Scirocco. A Scirocco is a, an innovative computer cleaner. It's a self-contained machine that goes down over the entire computer box. Let me explain how it works. First, there's a fan run by a motor. The fan propels air into the bottom chamber, which then re-enters through these side holes. The air that you pump into the bottom carries with it dust, which it then filters. The air returns into the top chamber, then re-enters through the fan to create a recycling system. It's easy to use. It prevents dust from blowing into the environment, and more importantly, it works. That's really our focus with the Shrucker. That's what it's all about. It's about helping the community. It's about uh, extending into the workplace, businesses, hospitals. There's never been a day where we come in here and we don't feel like we're working on it. We always want to, you know, find something to do with it. Yeah. We're all <clears throat> inspired by it. I mean, it's this is our masterpiece. I mean, this is the biggest thing we've done. So we all want to contribute and make it perfect. And Nick will come in every day and you know he'll have a vision for us and you know he, he's always the one who organizes me especially. Amber she's really good with organizing. She really helps with the shirts a lot. She set up all the surveys we had to do. Dylan has all the resources okay. you could possibly imagine. I mean we needed a new fan. You know he's looking at the fan. He's always setting up meetings. Justin of course he's the motion study guy. I mean Solid. he's SolidWorks. I mean he's I mean if we had, if we didn't have Justin, I mean, we couldn't have done anything. Ray is definitely the person to make sure we don't miss anything. He's if, most enthusiastic. Yeah, if we're talking about something or if we're learning something new, he's going to ask the questions to make sure we have all the information we need. Right. And then Arthur's is there <clears throat> ultimately to bring us, you know, to the ground. I mean, we're a family and every family would say have their problems and Arthur's is the person to break us down and be like, look, we got to settle down, everybody calm down. Right. We're not in bad shape, we're still in really good shape. This is where we're going. We've all really gotten to know each other a lot better than we had before, and we've, we've really become friends really well, so. Yep. It's been a huge experience for all of us. We're like a family, basically. We're the Scirocco family. <laughs>